Welcome back. Power to the people, they say. One of the things I like about this channel is collecting viewer feedback. And I received a few comments on this video I recently took of Actually Smart Summon. Some people noted that I, it actually ran through a stop sign, which I originally did not notice. Here is the stop sign in question. If you look at this video, I was actually pretty happy with how Smart Summon went around this vehicle. Now, I thought it had stopped here as part of it stopping uh, at that stop sign, but you can see it's still very far back. And if you notice, the stop sign is on the left where it's typically uh, located here on the right side. As you can see, the vehicle takes off and it doesn't stop again at the line it actually goes through it slows down a little bit here when it sees that suv on the left going in front of it but if that suv wasn't there it was actually going to go through that stop sign so yes that is an absolute defect there and that's a great catch from my viewers well done so i thought hey let's try it out again today and see if it has the same problem in the same location so we're at the exact uh, same costco same parking location and uh, we're gonna reverse out. You can see there's a person there behind the car. So Smart Summon did a good job waiting for them to pass. And uh, we're gonna see if it goes right through that stop sign again. Feel free to place your bets right now. Okay, cautiously going out, doing a good job. As you can see there, there's a pedestrian in front waiting for them to pass and then moving forward. There are some other comments where people are saying like smart summon is going too too slowly through in the parking lot like i don't know how you drive through a costco parking lot but i think the speed is more than fine as you can see here it's gonna have to turn left you have a few vehicles that are passing in front of it it's gonna cautiously and patiently wait for them you can see there there's a shopper there on the left waiting for them to pass do a nice left turn there could it go a little bit faster maybe a little bit but i wouldn't say too much all right, here we go. There's that stop sign on the left. Let's see what happens again. As you can see, it doesn't stop at all. It goes right through. So yes, absolutely a defect there. You can see the car slows down a little bit now for those pedestrians on the right. But again, if they weren't there, it would go through. So I think it's having problems recognizing that sign on the left, whether it's the angle or it's just that the stop sign is on the left. So again, here again is the positioning of that stop sign. And for some reason, uh, the Tesla actually smart summons not picking it up. So we're going to try it again here at a different location. This time we're going to go through another parking lot and we're going to go through a stop sign. Now this time the stop sign is going to be on the right. Let's see if it does a better job of recognizing it. Right now we're just going to wait for this pedestrian to pass through and then we'll activate the actually smart summon. Okay, all ready to go. Let's go. This time we're going to be leaving the parking space going for the front. Nice turn to the right, slows down, waits for that vehicle to pass. Turning right again, and we're about to get up to that stop sign. Now you can see this time that the stop sign is going to be located on my right. It's doing a job moving up to it. Again, we've got that pedestrian moving in front. The pedestrian has passed through the stop sign. And let's see if the vehicle stops this time. And yes, it does a complete full stop. So this time it did recognize the stop sign. So I'm just wondering if it's an issue with the location of the stop sign. You can see me there on the right there, just beyond. And the vehicle stopped because it actually sensed that it thought I was going to be walking in front of it. Now look what happens. I'm going to step back a few steps and then the smart summon picks up again. So it does a great job with the pedestrian detection there. Fantastic pedestrian detection. So there you go. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to test out some more uh, parking lots that have got stop signs on the left and see if uh, Smart Summon still has issues with it. But definitely something for Tesla to go address. I want to thank everyone for uh, watching these videos and leaving the comments. It's because of that that we were able to uh, discover that there was a little bit of a defect here. Hopefully uh, the folks at Tesla are taking a look at this video. Your support is always appreciated. Feel free to like and subscribe if you like content like this. I'll see you all soon.